Welcome to the Velvet Room. I... Which will you choose? This would be a wise choice. What do you wish to inherit? <laughs> A new power emerges. It is a special persona you desire, is it not? This is your progress so far. Does that persona catch your eye? This persona, so you'll be summoning this one? Very well, it's yours. Very well. Reg is overriding acceptable? All registered. Are you in... Please, choose the personas you would like to fuse. See 
seeing what personas come to be is a great joy of mine. Shall we get going? We don't have all night, you know. There's still a curfew. Hey, let's go to Polonia Mall. I hear they're gonna have lights up. Everything must feel so different under that kind of atmosphere. To be honest, I've been looking forward to it. all night long. Did you know they brought in a famous designer for these decorations? Here, I have a present for you. It's been a while since I've made something like this. I hope it tastes all right. You got a present for me? It feels nice to know someone's thinking about you. <laughs> Thanks. That was really thoughtful. Honestly, when I first met you, I never thought we'd end up spending Christmas together like this. I was just so used to being all on my own. I'm only gonna tell you this because it's a special day, but I actually always dreamed of doing something like this. <sighs> I know that with everything going on, it's not exactly the time to be getting all warm and fuzzy. But one night couldn't hurt, right? Just for today. I want to be by your side. Oh, shoot. Look at the time. Sure, it's fine. We can't be the only ones staying out late on a day like this, right? 
Except for Junpei, I guess. I can't imagine him having a romantic evening out. Ugh, sorry, that isn't the point. I just want to stay with you a little longer. Hey, are you cold? It's chilly, right? Can I come closer? I was hoping you could keep me warm, maybe. today. <sighs> Which is what I believe to be the proper way to wear one's uniform. Please keep these things in consideration. I'm not saying everyone should follow this to the letter, so we'll leave it to the discretion of the individual. Holy crap! Did that just come out of his mouth? I think this is the first time he's cared about anyone else's opinions. Well, at least he's trying. Thank you. I couldn't have done it without you. So, how did I do? What did everyone think? Thanks. Hearing that takes a huge weight off my shoulders. I may have painted a selfish, arrogant portrait of myself to everyone, so I'll have to win back their trust. Here, look at this. One of the guys fessed up about the cigarette butt in the boys' bathroom. It took a lot of persuasion, but he promised me he'll never smoke again. This lighter is proof of that. I earned his trust by showing compassion for others. Just like you taught me, that's why you should be the one to have it. I spent my whole life looking down on others. Such baseless bravado. But you taught me an important lesson. Something I'll carry with me forever. I don't think I'll ever be anything like you, though. I am thou. Thou art I. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Emperor Arcana have been set free. We now bestow upon him the ultimate form of the Emperor within thyself. Do you remember the story I told you about the TV station's writer, that man? He's my father. I see now that sincerity is important, and I'm proud of myself for understanding that. I also realized what an amazing man my father is. It's about time to go. Say, do you want to stop by somewhere before we head home? Now that I think about it, we've never hung out outside of school before. See you back. Hmm.
Having one big sale today. You can't find you made up your mind. That's all. Thanks for coming. Which ones? Thanks for coming. You made up your mind. Thanks for coming. You got it. Which ones? That's all. Thanks for coming. You made up your mind. Thanks for coming. Which ones? That's all. Thanks. That's all. Thanks for coming. You made up. Uh, thanks for coming. Which ones? Thanks. You made up. Uh, thanks for coming. You made up your mind. Thanks for coming. You got everything you need. Come again, yeah. Oh yeah. Now you're here. I owe you one. Good to see you. What'd you bring? Wanna... Alright, I'll take that. All done here? Be seeing you. about something I didn't understand in class. But then it led to even more questions, so <laughs> I was stuck there for a while. 
Oh, this is so heavy. I shouldn't have crammed everything in there. Nope, they're reference books. There were so many things I wanted to ask. I ended up bringing the books for every subject. Whenever I come to this field, I get so nostalgic. It hasn't even been that long since we coached those kids, though, huh? You said it. I had to really put my brains and body to work. I've never had to run around like that. Not even for the track team. Oh, that's right. Here, take this. It's from those kids. They told me to make sure I give it to my boyfriend. Whoa, I didn't think you'd react like that. I mean, isn't that pretty unusual for you? Anyways, I'll be sure to let the kids know you liked it. They'll be super happy to hear. When you get something like this, it makes you forget how tough it was in the moment. <laughs> Kinda makes me want to do it all again. What about you? <laughs> Glad to hear it. Oh, and while we're at it, we should invite more people to coach with us next time. Once I'm caught up on school, I'd like to take some time to think. Not just about coaching, but about enjoying life and stuff too. I hope you can wait for me until then. I'll make sure I study hard. Oh, right. If I do manage to become an athletic trainer, my first job will be putting together a training routine for you. You probably won't become a pro athlete, so I'll try not to make it too intense. I am thou. Thou art I. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost path of the strength arcana hath been set free. We now bestow upon thee the ultimate form of the strength within thyself. go buy some reference books. See you around. Oh, it's you. I suppose.
Our hero took an underdog baseball team that didn't even have enough players all the way to nationals. No matter how tough the rival or desperate the situation, the hero always ends up finding a way. Hey, we're technically a team too, aren't we? Means we need a hot shot of our own, right? <laughs> Don't sweat it. We've already got ourselves a major hot shot. Me, everyone else has got their own strengths. Kind of like the characters in a manga. Either way, kind of blows that real life can't be like how it is in a manga. Anywho, on to the next page. Oh yeah, that's right. Just before the big game, the hero collapses. All after getting everyone together, training like crazy, becoming a hot shot hitter, and carrying the whole team all by himself. Dying to know what happens next, huh? Then I'll borrow the rest of the volume from my buddy, Pronto. Junbei-kun? Ah, oh, hey, Fuka. What brings you here? Ah, uh, nothing really. I've been coming here a bunch lately. Is that sketchbook... um... Hmm? Oh, yeah. This is where Chidori and I first met. What are you doing here, Fuka? Oh, I went home for a bit. I've been going back a lot recently. Oh, yeah? You know, you've really changed, Fuka. You're a totally different person from when you first showed up. I am? Honestly, you were kind of a wimp before. But now, you're something else. I can't even describe it. You've changed too, Jinpei-kun. Yukatan said the exact same thing, but uh, I just don't see it myself. I mean, just the other day I was freaking out and throwing all that blame around. I'm a real piece of work, aren't I? That's not true. Man, I was so damn scared. I just couldn't keep my shit together. I know. I hate to admit it, but even now, I can't help being scared. You're only scared because you're choosing not to run away. We all feel that way. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Luca. That's why I want to protect everyone. After all, the dark hour is horrifying to think about, isn't it? But our persona's awakened, and we're here now. The future hasn't been written in stone yet, and I want to be true to myself. True to yourself. Hmm. You're really something, Fuka. Let's fight together. Okay. Marvelous. I'm looking forward to... Are you accepting a request? Very well.
day. Here are my requests. <laughs> the look in your eyes. It's strong, fierce. A far cry from how you looked the day we first met. Very well, then. Give me a minute, so I can calm down. The pain comes and goes, but I'll be fine once it passes. It's getting better. Thanks. I stopped taking my medicine. It's not going to cure me anyway, right? It just eases my pain and suffering. My medicine makes me drowsy, and if my hands go numb, then I can't write. I have to finish my story. The reason I haven't finished my story is because I haven't found the meaning of my life yet. I'll get absorbed in my writing, erase it, and then lose sight of how to reach the end. When I'm with you, I can almost see it. It's because you've been here for me. It seems like you might have given me a reason to finish. I'm probably writing this book to find my own meaning in life. And if I do find it, if I do finish the story, I hope we have a little more time together after that. Day, but I hope to see you again. Welcome back. No, okay. Get a load of this. In that case, I 
see you're reading a biography of the Empress Dowager from the Qing Dynasty. By many accounts, she was vilified as a ruthless despot during her reign. Then again, these kinds of stories are known to stretch the truth. Oh, pardon me. I'm getting ahead of myself. I should let you read first. Is the right way for a person to rule. Too much kindness and you'll be seen as weak. Sometimes a ruler needs to be harsh. Even so, I imagine the Empress Dowager's final years must have been lonely, given that she was feared by her people. What do you think? A ruler is responsible for the lives of many others. Is it difficult for someone like that to find happiness like everyone else? Did it sound like I was talking about myself? It wasn't my intent to complain. I know what I'm getting into. I do appreciate your concern, though. Thank you. You know, thanks to you, I've been able to sit down and reflect on a reading for the first time in a while. It really does help to have a partner going through the same book as you. Being able to discuss the material allows us to broaden our horizons even further. Such storied figures are often only written about after their passing, but surely sparks of their greatness could have been seen long before. Sometimes I find myself thinking you have that same potential. <laughs> Am I? I'd like to say I'm a fairly good judge of character. In other words, I have faith in your abilities. I hope you're up to the task. Oh, it's gotten late. We'd best turn in for the evening. Let's have another reading session here in the future. But for now, have a good night.
in the last volume. We left off just as the hero passed out from pushing himself too hard. That part where his teammates managed to keep an even score while he's out was such a tearjerker. The game's almost over, and our hero, still weak after a short rest, steps up to bat. Hey, you totally get it. I honestly thought you wouldn't be into it so much. It's predictable, but it doesn't stop it from being awesome. Man, I forgot how good stories like these are. All right, now that we're at the best part, let's go full speed to the end. Whew. what a ride. The hero totally kicks everyone's asses in the end. And that part where he's so exhausted that he like surges with power, it's like his senses heightened to a whole nother level. Would it be so freaking cool if we could do that? Think so? It's gonna be intense, you know. It's what separates them from the masters. You can't just rely on raw strength. You gotta concentrate, let go of all that tension, then your power's all like, wom, wom, wom. and then you unleash it like, Pshoom! or maybe you power up like, then you let her rip. That makes sense? Dude, I think I might actually be able to pull this off. I gotta look into this more. Wanna read it one more time? Just the last part, I mean. And that, my friend, wraps up the series. Being alone's fine, but with gems like this one, it's better to share the fun with a pal. I'll bring you something else next time. We should do this again when you're free. Let's call it a night, shall we? Man, I'm gonna sleep like a log.
probably should probably head to bed. Have a good night. got good news. I guess it's coming back today. Mitsuru Senpai said her injuries are all healed up. We're meeting in the lounge tonight. Don't forget, okay? See ya.